And is it also true, this, is, this goes into the legend of Jeffrey D. Morgan, <laughs> oh, no. gentleman farmer, tough guy, is do you really also own a candy shop with Paul Yes, Rudd? yeah, that is you true. You own a candy shop? Yeah, we own a candy shop. Are you shop. Willy Wonka? <laughs> yeah. I don't... <laughs> What do you mean you own a candy shop? I don't know shop. exactly how this all happened in my life. We moved to upstate New York. I had lived in L.A. for years and mm -hmm. kind of paid my dues there and, and had done some films in, in upstate New York, and I loved the area, Hudson Valley. Uh -huh. And the first guy I met in this town called Ryan Beck uh, was this Ira, and he owned this candy store, and, and uh, he passed away. A couple years ago, and Paul and I have been friends for a while, and and we we just didn't want it to turn into you know a smoothie stand or something, and it had been there since the early 90s, and so we were like, yeah, let's pool our money together and and get a candy store. So now we are the proud owners of Samuel Sweet Shop. Oh really? Yeah. Well, what is um? <laughs> are you? All right, like, how old is your son? He is going to be six in March. Okay, so which is more impressive, like, uh, like TV <laughs> For my movie kids? star or candy shop? It's not even close. Although. He... He's not convinced that he knows exactly, or he doesn't know exactly what I do for a living. Like one day I'm a cowboy, or like I'm doing Walking Dead, so he knows that there's going to be some zombie killers. Oh, that's right. You're, you're yeah. Talking, yeah. So that's super exciting for him. But by far, the the candy store I think wins out. But for one, he thinks he owns it. You know, he sure. you know people come into the store if he's there, and he's like, "Welcome to my candy shop." <laughs> And then he steals the candy. Of course. Yeah, yeah. Put this on my father's yeah, account, yeah, my yeah, good man. Dad's got it. Mm, speak to the old man exactly. about this one.